One. When did Gary start his new job? Hello, Gary. I haven't seen you since March. Hi, Jane. No, I've been busy with my new job. Really? When did you start that? May. I left my last job in April. Now listen again. Hello, Gary. I haven't seen you since March. Hi, Jane. No, I've been busy with my new job. Really? When did you start that? May. I left my last job in April. Two. What time does the film start? Hello, Odeon Cinema. Could you tell me what time the film starts, please? Certainly. There are two screenings: one at four thirty and the other at seven. Thank you very much. Now listen again. Hello, Odeon Cinema. Could you tell me what time the film starts, please? Certainly. There are two screenings: one at four thirty and the other at seven. Thank you very much. Three. What was the weather like on Saturday? Did you have good weather at the beach at the weekend? Yes, it was sunny all weekend. Wasn't it windy too? Only on Sunday. Now listen again. Did you have good weather at the beach at the weekend? Yes, it was sunny all weekend. Wasn't it windy too? Only on Sunday. Four. Which motorway will they take? I've put the luggage in the car. Can we leave now? Okay, we'll go on the M6 motorway. Isn't it faster on the M1 and then the M62? Yes, usually, but there's been an accident on the M1, so I don't want to go that way. Now listen again. I've put the luggage in the car. Can we leave now? Okay, we'll go on the M6 motorway. Isn't it faster on the M1 and then the M62? Yes, usually, but there's been an accident on the M1, so I don't want to go that way. Five. Which book does Lorna want? Have you finished studying yet, Lorna? No, not yet. Could you give me that book, please? Which one? There are three here. This one on the sofa. No, the one on the chair next to the sofa, please. Now listen again. Have you finished studying yet, Lorna? No, not yet. Could you give me that book, please? Which one? There are three here. This one on the sofa. No, the one on the chair next to the sofa, please. Now look at part two. Hi Sue, have you been to the shops? Yes, I had some money for my birthday, so I decided to buy some clothes. I love those purple jeans. Yes, I bought them because purple is my favourite colour. I got a new jacket too. My old one is too small, so I bought this lovely big one. It's really great. Did you buy a dress? I got this one. Because it was only nine pounds. <gasps> That's not expensive. Then I got a sweater to wear with my jeans. Oh, it's lovely and soft. <laughs> That's why I bought it. Anything else? A coat. The long one I have is too big and heavy, but this one is really light. Did you buy a short white T-shirt like mine? Well, I bought a long white one. I'll wear it more often than a short one. Now listen again. Hi Sue, have you been to the shops? Yes, I had some money for my birthday, so I decided to buy some clothes. I love those purple jeans. Yes, I bought them because purple is my favourite colour. I got a new jacket too. 
My old one is too small, so I bought this lovely big one. It's really great. Did you buy a dress? I got this one because it was only nine pounds. <gasps> That's not expensive. Then I got a sweater to wear with my jeans. Ah,、oh, it's lovely and soft. <laughs> That's why I bought it. Anything else? A coat. The long one I have is too big and heavy, but this one is really light. Did you buy a short white T-shirt like mine? Well, I bought a long white one. I'll wear it more often than a short one. Now look at part three. Hi, Steve. Hi, Jan. I'm going to go to London on the train. Come with me. But it's cheaper by bus. I've got a student travel card. You can get cheap train tickets with it. Well, that sounds good. How much does it cost? A card for six months is sixteen pounds. So how do I get one? You need some photographs, one for the card and one for the form. Oh, there's a photo machine in the post office. It gives you four photos for three pounds. So does the one in the library. But I went to a photographer's shop. It was cheaper. I don't have to show my passport or my driving license, do I? That's right, Jan. You only need a letter from your college. I'll ask my teacher for one. And then you take everything to the tourist office by the travel agents. Great. Next time you go to London, I'll come too. Now listen again. Hi, Steve. Hi, Jan. I'm going to go to London on the train. Come with me. But it's cheaper by bus. I've got a student travel card. You can get cheap train tickets with it. Oh,、well, that sounds good. How much does it cost? A card for six months is sixteen pounds. So how do I get one? You need some photographs, one for the card and one for the form. Oh, there's a photo machine in the post office. It gives you four photos for three pounds. So does the one in the library. But I went to a photographer's shop. It was cheaper. I don't have to show my passport or my driving license, do I? That's right, Jan. You only need a letter from your college. I'll ask my teacher for one. And then you take everything to the tourist office by the travel agents. Great. Next time you go to London, I'll come too. Now look at part four. Waterhouse School, can I help you? Hello. Can I leave a message for Mr. Brown, please? Yes, of course. What's your name? David Graham. Could you spell your surname for me, please? Yes, it's G R A H A M. Right, I've got that.、Uh, what's the message? Well, I can't teach my classes for a few days because my back's bad again. Oh dear, a bad back. Yes. Can you ask Mr. Brown to tell the students to read their course book? They should start at page fifty-eight and read to page seventy-three. Okay, I've got that.、Uh, anything else?、Uh, yes. Tell Mr. Brown that I've been to the doctor and I can't come back to work until Tuesday. That's in the morning, is it? No, not until the afternoon. I'll be there for my first class. It starts at quarter past two. Right. I'll tell him. I hope you feel better soon. Thanks very much. Bye. Goodbye. Now listen again. Waterhouse School, can I help you? Hello. Can I leave a message for Mr. Brown, please? Yes, of course. What's your name? David Graham. Could you spell your surname for me, please? Yes. It's G R A H A M. Right, I've got that.、Uh, what's the message? Well, I can't teach my classes for a few days because my back's bad again. Oh dear, a bad back. Yes. Can you ask Mr. Brown to tell the students to read their course book? They should start at page fifty-eight and read to page seventy-three. Okay, I've got that.、Uh, anything else?、Uh, yes. Tell Mr. Brown that I've been to the doctor. And I can't come back to work until Tuesday. That's in the morning, is it? No, not until the afternoon. I'll be there for my first class. It starts at quarter past two. Right. I'll tell him. I hope you feel better soon. Thanks very much. Bye. Goodbye.
Now look at part five. You are listening to Radio South. Here is some information about a pop concert. The group Red River will come to London soon. They will be in London from the 28th of October to the 2nd of November. After that, they will be in Oxford from the 4th of November until the 9th. Tickets are quite expensive. They cost £37 each, but half of that money will go to a children's hospital. Tickets will sell quickly for this famous band, so book early. To book a ticket for a London concert, telephone 283-0065 between 10 a.m. and 10 p.m. Have a credit card number ready. The London concerts will be in South Bank Hall. It's very easy to find. The best way to get there is to take the train. The concert hall is in Trinity Street. That's T R I N I T Y Street. See you there. For classical music. Now listen again. You are listening to Radio South. Here is some information about a pop concert. The group Red River will come to London soon. They will be in London from the 28th of October to the 2nd of November. After that, they will be in Oxford from the 4th of November until the 9th. Tickets are quite expensive. They cost £37 each, but half of that money will go to a children's hospital. Tickets will sell quickly for this famous band, so book early. To book a ticket for a London concert, telephone 283-0065 between 10 a.m. and 10 p.m. Have a credit card number ready. The London concerts will be in South Bank Hall. It's very easy to find. The best way to get there is to take the train. The concert hall is in Trinity Street. That's T R I N I T Y Street. See you there. For classical music.